today's video is a what i eat in a week at a catered uct res so i just wanted to show you guys just to give you an idea this video includes lots of different foods and obviously i don't eat like this every week and it also includes lots of coffee i mean a lot of coffee i really hope you enjoy the video and please please pretty please don't forget to comment if you like the video hi guys and welcome back to another video on my channel so in today's video i decided to do a what i eat in a week and this is sort of to give you an idea of what kind of food you can get at a uct catered res and obviously they do have lots of different options of food you can get so this is just what i choose to eat and then also this this video was filmed over various stages so some of it was filmed before i went on vacation some of it was filmed filmed after vacation and i am a vegetarian now so you're gonna see some of the meals are vegetarian meals but that's just because i decided to mix up the days and stuff and lastly i do really hope that you enjoy this video and it sort of gives you an idea you know of the food that i eat in a week and i don't usually have breakfast but for the sake of the video i decided to force myself to have breakfast on some days just to make the video more interesting and if i am going to have breakfast i would rather have fancy breakfast so that's why some of the breakfasts are a bit on the extra side i'm like if i'm gonna force myself i might as well just be extra with it so yeah so for lunch we had some butternut and chicken and then we also have donut had donuts which i loved because we don't get dessert like every day most of the time they'll have like fruit or something then for supper i ordered some sushi ah i loved sushi and um i ordered these spring rolls and they were also amazing and the sushi was amazing obviously And then the last thing I ate before, not ate, I drank before I went to sleep was this like store-bought quick cappuccino thing that I had. It's really good. I like this flavor. And I usually stir it very vigorously so that it can like dissolve properly. And yeah, that was it for the first day. For lunch i had some fish and then this was coffee and i also had this dessert i don't know what's in it but i think it's like pears and stuff it's so good and for a snack in the middle of the afternoon i had some papa bites and coke zero creamed spinach and this i believe this was chicken kebab or it might have been like beef kebab between the two i can't even remember i'm so sorry <laughs> had black coffee in the morning and if you're og subscriber you know how i love my black coffee in the morning it just sets me up you know and then for lunch i had some marvel pudding and i just realized that there are a lot of desserts in this video and it isn't usually like this but yeah uh for lunch i had <laughs> the pudding the marvel pudding and then i also had this cheese and salami sandwich which is so good and then and i had oranges as an afternoon snack had some butternut and this like vegetarian baked thing it was just pasta with a lot of vegetables and the cheese over top and i like to put like tomato sauce on everything so on this day i didn't have breakfast eating it and then for lunch i had this but there was butternut and there was samp and the stew which was so good it had mainly spinach and the beans and it was so spicy so good i loved it and then for uh dinner i had chicken and what is this a squash yeah i don't usually drink a uh, fruit juice anymore but this girl in the lift gave me this and she was so nice i just put the food on a plate i don't know why because i don't usually do this i this morning i had coffee with soy milk that's why the color kind of looks muddy like that and then i decided to cut up some fruits uh usually i would just eat them like that but because for the sake of the video <laughs> i decided to cut up the fruits which is not actually a good idea because i didn't have a proper knife and then i tried to uh get someone to lend me their knife but no one had one so i just used the plastic knife <laughs> Um 
meu lugar Tem seus gritos e seres de luz É bem Lunch, I had some spinach and this lentil soup This was so good It was like the right amount of spicy I loved it Ah, uh, amazing And then for dinner I had some chips and pork ribs Okay, so like I said, if I'm going to eat breakfast, I might as well make it fancy. So I had a yogurt parfait on this day, which was just yogurt, apples, and some muesli. And it was amazing. I ate that in bed while I was reading. Then afterwards, I had some coffee, and I know I haven't been showing it a lot in the video, but I always, always drink water. I drink so much water, like two liters every day. I make sure. And then for lunch, I had this fried rice, I'm gonna call it. I like to mix tomato sauce and beri beri. It just makes the right, like, spicy sauce. And then I had potatoes, vegetarian nuggets, and also baby carrots and peas. On Sunday, as usual, I had my black coffee in the morning and I had muesli and some yogurt. Then for lunch, I had these veggie sausages and potatoes. They were garlic potatoes as well, so good. In the afternoon, I had some uh, Lay's. They went off with this flavor, I'm telling you. The flavor, oh my God, it just, it's so real, like, mm. Then in the afternoon, I had coffee as well. I usually have two coffees in a day, which I don't think is bad, okay? Please don't come for me. I, I personally don't think it's bad. And then for dinner, I'd already taken a bite out of this fish because I forgot I was recording. But I had chips and this fish. Oh, child, that was a lot of talking. But I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. And if you did, please like this video. Please actually, please leave a comment, please, because that really, really helps me out. Um, and yeah, if you'd like more of these videos, please tell me, especially now that I'm vegetarian, I feel like it would be interesting to do what I eat in a week. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.